things that are different things But we found love And we found love Hey everyone uh, yeah, we just got back from the Golden Crust and some supermarkets and uh, tomorrow is going to be a special day. Crystal's going to teach me how to make jerk chicken. Yeah, she beat me in the head with a frying pan. That's why my, that's why my face is swollen. <laughs> no, I'm joking. It's... I thought it was the voodoo doll. No, it's the frying pan. Yeah, well, voodoo doll, frying pan. Either way, you're beating me with a oh, needle. Oh, yeah. Look at don't show at, me, but that's, uh, I, I'm showing him how to eat patty with the coca bread. Yeah, even though it hurts to open my mouth that wide. But did it taste good? <laughs> yeah, it was good. I liked it. A little spicy, but not too much. The bread cools it down. But uh, we're going to... Oh, uh, let's, and I bought sugar bun and cheese. I don't know if we're gonna video that, but I'm gonna let him try it. If it if he likes it, then I'm, I'll let I'm, you guys know. In my mind, I'm guessing it's the same thing as the Easter bun. Uh, not really. It has a different flavor. But we'll catch you guys later. It's, it's raining, and we're getting out of the car. So yeah, right. we're gonna end up uh, unloading our groceries, so we'll catch you in a moment. Hey guys, so I'm not gonna show you guys me uh, cleaning up the chicken, but. I figured you guys, I'm making thigh quarters. Is it quarters? Yeah. So, in the side, there's usually like this part right here. Just take that out. Nobody want to bite into chicken and bite into that. Why are you laughing? <laughs> I'm not. And most side, it comes with like the. I think it is what part of the chicken is. <laughs> <laughs> you just cut that off I forgot to show you guys so yeah but that's it I'm not gonna take the skin off because it keeps the juice in the chicken and I'm gonna be washing the chicken so can you pass that vinegar I don't have to wash my hand again the apple cider yeah pass that one spray it um, open it yeah so I'm just gonna be washing the chicken Pour it on it. How much? I'll tell you when to stop. Pour it off. Stop. Yeah. So you just wash. Pour apple cider vinegar. You could use lime juice. Sherbel. <laughs> you could use lime juice, and you just wash it off in some water. And we're gonna get into seasoning the chicken. All right, catch you guys in a bit. All right, guys. Welcome back. Are you ready, Bill? Yeah. <laughs> Pause. Alright, so these are like the raw ingredients. I have green onion, thyme, ginger, onion, and Jamaican scotch bonnet, scotch bonnet pepper, and jerk season. This right here is the Walkers with jerk season. It's a hot and spicy one. You could use the mild. I just like stuff spicy. It tastes better that way. We like it mild, but I, I didn't put a lot on it. Alright, so in and this, the garlic. oh, I didn't say the garlic, and that's minced garlic. There you go. And this is adobe. I like like using this on my chicken. I think it gives it a lot of flavor. So I put some there. I, I won't be using soy sauce. I'll be using some Rochester sauce. Uh, Jimmy, because I really use that, they'll use like browning. And I recommend putting bear on your chicken. I think it gives it a way better flavor. I won't be using beer in this recipe because Bill, as you guys know, he is sick. Well, He's on you can because when you cook with alcohol, the alcohol goes away. More. Yeah, but just to be on the safe side, so I won't be using it. But you guys can either, when you're when it's on the grill, you could pour it on the chicken. Or if you just want to tip, it, t um, tip some in the thing when it's um, seasoning, I recommend it. It's, don't use this brand though. I was just gonna use this because it's the only beer we had. Use Jamaican Red Stripe and I'll definitely drop a clip in it so you guys see how that looks. Don't worry about the recipe. I'll leave it in the details for you. And that's it, ready to get started though. Well, that's what I was gonna say, it was Red Stripe. I figured it's Jamaican jerk chicken. So. Yeah, so I just picked that up because I didn't have that. But yeah, that's what I use. All right, so the chicken is here, babe. 
Um, guys, can you believe Bill didn't wash his hands? We'll be right back. All right, babe, so go ahead and take up the raw seasoning and take the onion up, pour the onion in there. It's up to you. There's no right or wrong way what to put in first. I mean, it's all getting mixed in. So all of it? You, you yep. got a pre measured one? Okay. Everything is all measured up for you. If you wanted to just pick the plate up, put the green onions in, <coughs> the ginger. So guys, if you watch your video when I was showing him how to make uh, bun and cheese, just I half told, or just what's cut? Just what's cut. I just put it there so let me. If you guys, didn't, that's how Jamaican scotch bonnet look, guys. So just look out for that when you go to the store. Yeah, if you guys watch our last video when I was showing him um, the bun and cheese, and I said one of the things I want him to learn how to make was well, jerk chicken. Um, but yesterday was Fourth of July, day before yesterday. So go ahead and mix it all in. Oh, uh, this too? Yep. <laughs> hold on, babe. Hold the hold the camera. Make sure. You gonna you got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm just gonna move it around. It looks a little stiff there. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I finally got around to it because it was Fourth of July. We had a grill. And I figured, why not just, this is like the perfect time to like show him how to do it. Alright, hold on, hold this babe, let me show you. Mm -hmm. I want all that seasoning in there. I should have used like a cutting board to mix it in. I am going to add some more powdered season. This is just the season I want on it. I think it would work better if we had a bigger bowl too. But we got to make do with what we got. We, had a, we have a cutting board or something I could put it on. We have like bacon dish. We have a lot of stuff we could put in. But this is fine. This is just like the season. I'm going to put more adobe. I put... Um, I put... Sweet tea. Are you inhaling all that? Smells good. It's not even cooked and it smells good. <laughs> I should put some of that bear on it, but I don't want you. To no, have I'll be fine because when you cook with alcohol, baby, it, uh, it's, it just leaves the flavor, the alcohol. Yeah, I'll just put it on it when it's on the grill tomorrow, like halfway through. Alright, guys, so that's just the part of for the raw seasoning. This, I'm gonna. I might as well just show you guys everything. Alright guys, so I just added a little bit more jerk season to it. I added some of the Rochester. Yeah, Rochester. I can't say that word. Rochester. Whatever. Rochester. Rochester. Rochester sucks. What? Rochester shire. It's like you said something else a while ago. Alright guys, so this smells so good. Yeah, if there, oh, there needs to be smell, smell of too, so you can smell this good cooking. <laughs> Alright guys, so with the pimento, um, I mean the jerk season, you have like pimento seed in it. You, this is the ingredient. You have scallion, scotch bonnet, pepper, salt, black pepper, allspice, nutmeg, citric acid, cane sugar, and salt, which is basically all the raw ingredients, but I still put it in there first. I think this one has pimento in it. I'm gonna check the ingredients further, but I recommend putting pimento seed. It gives it this nice flavor too. All right, so that's it. We're just gonna wrap it up. Where the scissors, baby? Hold it tight. It's tight. I'll just wrap it. Yeah guys, so you just wrap it up and leave it in the fridge to marinate for the night and we'll catch you guys tomorrow when we're grilling. Later. Bye. Uh, good morning everyone. It's day two. There's someone driving in the back. But uh, I'm going to show you guys how to start the grill up. Um, a lot of people don't know or don't care to know, but this is how you do it. You want the charcoals to be nice and hot before you put the food on. 
That way you're not wasting time. All right. Now this charcoal's a Kingsford match light, so you don't need any lighter fluid. You just take your lighter to it, and it'll catch. You just light up a couple pieces. You let them I'm burn. Weird for like liking this. Like, <laughs> it looks like something you set a massage. If you want to accelerate it, you can use some lighter fluid. Hey, that's cool. You gotta let it burn. It's gonna spread to all the other charcoal. You just let that burn like that. And uh, once you're done, we'll slide this in here inside, and it will heat up in, on the inside. Close that lid. All right. I'll let that burn for a minute. Guys, okay, so this is how the chicken, I took the chicken out after having it in there overnight. I just put some more Richesha sauce on it and a little more jerk season. And if you're not sure like of the amount of season, to, as I said, it's just like measuring how much chicken you're doing and see how much season you need to put on it. Just kind of like go that way your finger. Don't show me. <laughs> I look horrible, guys. <laughs> But like taste your finger and taste it and see if it's like, like if it tastes okay. Just a little talk because I don't want you guys getting sick, but yeah. <laughs> I mean, we do that in Jamaica. We just do a little finger test on the seasoning and see if it tastes okay. All right, guys. Catch you guys. I'm going to end. We're just it. Okay. Okay. Some people pour olive oil on it when they're seasoning it. I don't, I don't think it's already dark. I don't feel like you don't need any oil. The chicken, the fat in the chicken looks good. Olive oil is pretty good. Cool. So. Alright guys, that's it. We'll get back. We're 10 minutes. Hey guys, so how lucky are you guys? You guys are getting to see how to do like two stuff in one video. This is called a bread fruit. Bill was asking, is it a fruit or a bread? <laughs> it's like starchy. So, like, so this is like a green bread fruit. I'm roasting it. And that's what we're going to eat with the jerk chicken. It's almost done. You just keep turning it. And when it's done, you just like stick something. If it goes through, and it's like bacon. If it goes through, and when it comes out, you don't see anything on it, you know it's done. Like that, it's almost done. Just leave it there for a few minutes and then take it out. But that's how you make a bread first. Just keep turning it. You could do it on the stove. I was doing it on the stove. Bill got mad. So I brought it out here because it was like smoking. But you could do it on the stove if you have like. I ain't gonna tell them that. <laughs> Bye guys. Catch you in a minute. <laughs> Some people pour olive oil on it when they're seasoning it. I don't, I don't think it's already dark I don't feel like you don't need any oil. The chicken, the fat in the chicken looks good. Olive oil is pretty good. So. Alright guys, that's it. We'll get back. We're 10 minutes in. Alright guys, so we're 20 minutes in. Bear, I told you about. We're gonna put some on it. We're gonna put some on it. <laughs> Alright guys, so we have 20 minutes left and the chicken will be all done and we'll catch you guys inside when it's ready. Alright, there you have it guys. This is a finished product. We have the jerk chicken, festival, and some plantains. This is the hot sauce I was telling you guys about. Um, that you just uh, soak in vinegar, the hot, um, so hot scotch bennet wrapper. Just soak it in vinegar. He should have been in the kitchen. Guys, I'm teaching him, but he disappeared. And there you have it. You can decorate it just like that. Make a little boat. Put your festival in. We did make uh, the roast breadfruit, but uh, at least you guys see how that's done. You could eat it with breadfruit. I didn't want to eat it with it, so we'll just eat it in the week when we're ready. 
Alright, yeah, guys, I got dressed, so I figured I should be in there. <laughs> there you go. So, this is a jerk chicken. It's something Crystal makes in Jamaica. Well, a lot of people in Jamaica make jerk chicken. I made ribs the other on one of our previous videos. Make sure you go watch that video as well. Um, leave a comment down below on what dish you like to cook out on a grill or what dish you cook out for your nationality. I know everyone has different walks of life. I want and if you want, send us a recipe. We'll try and make it on camera for you. Yep, and I then I'll have Crystal taste it. Why I have to taste you're gonna taste it. Because some some countries like to grill crickets. What? <laughs> Okay, but I know you guys have leftover. We see we have like the flag in our boat or whatever. I know you guys have leftover food like chicken and you have the grill, the stuff for the grill from 4th of July. So just go ahead and make it. Comment down below if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video with your family and friends if you make jerk chicken. If I can make it, you can make it. Look like you're a bad cook. <laughs> It is, guys. Catch you in a bit. Bye. Bye. Some fine rings that are different things, but we found out.